Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to Boss Labs. My name is Chewy and I just want to do a quick video. I saw on social media that Atomos updated the uh, Ninja line and recorders they have to support the uh, Canon C80 uh, via HDMI. So I have my Ninja 5 right here, my Ninja 5 Plus. And so what this update does is it allows you to record 6K60 out of the HDMI port of the C80, which is something the camera can't do internally at all. The C400 that I'm shooting on right now can do 6K60 internally. The C80 can't. It's capped out at 30 frames a second in raw light at 6K. So that's a really cool update for a piece of gear that I already had. Now I did run into um, not really an issue, just um, you know I had to fumble through the menus and I want to talk about that really quick. So once I updated the firmware on the Atomos Ninja, that was fine, no problems there. I plugged it into my C80 and I realized that the raw HDMI out on the menu system was grayed out. It took me a second, looked through Canon's menus um, and I couldn't quite figure it out. So I went online and I found this page on the Canon C80 manual. So I had to set my camera to 60p to begin with. So that, that menu item is grayed out unless you go to 60p. And once you select that, you'll notice that you can click on it, you can click on, and then you can be outputting 6K RAW out of your C80 onto your Atomos Ninja recorders. And I think that's really cool. And um, I've noticed another thing that was also stated in the manual was that you can still record onto slot B, but you can't record onto slot A. So once you enable RAW out and you have that going to your Atomos recorder, you'll notice that where you usually have your uh, card information and how much time you have left, it'll say raw via HDMI out or whatever. But if you go into your menu system and you select card B, you'll get two options. You can still do a proxy record and a sub record to slot B. The slot A is taken out by the HDMI out. So basically you'll notice that it'll say, you know, slot A is taken up by the HDMI and slot B, you can select whether you want it on or off in those two modes. So. Hopefully this video helps somebody out who's in the same place I am. I got lost for, you know, a handful of minutes. And I think a YouTube video would have been a lot more helpful than having to read a manual. So make sure your settings are set to 60p and then you'll be able to select raw HDMI out. And you can't record onto your SD cards unless you're doing a proxy or a sub record to slot B when you're doing 6K 60 Pro Raw out of your HDMI on the Canon C80. And I think this is a really cool feature. I think it really allows me, if I really, really need to match my C400, being able to shoot 6K60, I can now do it in a slightly more compact form factor. Um, I would probably try to figure something else out than using the handle. Um, maybe I would just put it on top here. But regardless, I think it's cool that Atomos had this update and it's just giving me functionality that I didn't have internally on my camera and it makes it that much better for my clients. So. Anyways, thanks for watching. I hope this video was somewhat helpful to somebody and we'll see you next time. Peace.